Yep, 347. Live with the Grapevine. This is the Kosher Wine Review. I'm Yoshua Worth. And today we're finishing up our little expression from France. This is one of the top notch of all the Rhone wines. This is Chateauneuf de Pap. I've had one other Chateauneuf de Pap. They can blend as many as 14 or 15 different grape strains. This one they chose three. Grenache, Mavadre, and Syrah. 16 months in French oak. And I have never tasted this wine, smelled this wine, or held this bottle in my hand until right now. I am thoroughly impressed with the last Chateau of the Pap I had. It has a mouthfeel and fruit flavors unlike any other wine I've had. There's something about the region and the stylings that are quite captivating. This is the 2011. And their basic notes coming from the bottle is an estate bottle. They own the vineyards. Um, 55 year old vines. Wow, drink within two to 10 years. So when they say drink within two to 10 years, means this is 2011. They didn't want anybody drinking the wine until now, even though the wine itself was probably finished six months ago. rich, heavier, much heavier than the other wines. Here you get some oak. Oak, some dark fruit. What do they say? Let's see. What do, they, what, what do the winemakers smell? Black fruit and spice. Yeah, dark fruit. Big dark fruit. They didn't say anything about the wood. I'm definitely getting the wood on this. Beautiful, beautiful. Imagine a citrus rind rubbed straight down the center of an oak stave and black fruit with some light spice ran across the top of that, make a sandwich and take a bite. That's what I smell. Yeah, just black blackberries, dark fruit. I already said a brocha. A couple of them now. Hmm. Just the beginnings of a full bodied wine. Beautiful, lighter, juicy, like sweet tannins, creaminess, light wood, little jam. Wow. Dry wine too, big dry wine. Nice gripping wine, young. I'd love to taste this in like four days to see how this is gonna hold on over a long time. Super dark ex extracted color, big, big dark color. I mean, more on the, more on the black side of, of red. Not even purple, but just like black red. Again, the, on the nose and the palate, the wood comes through really nice in a balanced way. But it's, it's but it's up front at the same time. You know, that sounds like an oxymoron, but it works. Wow, this guy really knows how to make wine. <laughs>